Come on. We, we might need to uh, shave some weight on it. Holy crap. guys guess here and today we are back in the afg server american force gaming now i said before i was having a kind of like a flat off-road tow truck built well it just got shipped in from um vice city i got a guy down there that does a lot of stuff now i try to do a lot of hamster wheels but some things you know it's just a, lot, a whole lot better to get done now this is a f3 it's a f350 right yes f350 i said to make sure um now it does have a flatbed it's got water tires um it's leaf spring all around it's got the uh kind of the grumper but don't have it around the window i didn't really want that one to be able to see and of course it's got like the baja like mega raptor fender uh, flares on and also we got the cones flatbed it's got a fifth wheel hitch we got the jack the winch and uh the air pressure and we do have the caution lights on top now on the trailer, we've got boggers also on the trailer, a little bit smaller than a truck, so we can go off-road, because actually we're going to be using this today. Um, we've got an air compressor, a winch on it, and of course the cone stuff, in, and we can put cones uh, behind here or whatever. I've got cones on truck stuff so beside the road or something. We can put cones in the front, rear, or, you know, whatever like that. So we are ready to do some off-road recovery. We're actually, we got a call, Denise called me, she's like, hey, time to put that, you know, um, eighty thousand dollar truck to work and stuff so we've got to go almost to the top of mount chiliad because apparently there was a Polaris general or something that broke an axle or some sort like that so we're actually gonna go recover they didn't want to drive it down or anything because they didn't want to damage it or anything so i understand that so we're gonna go up there we'll probably do a lot of off-road recovery up in the mountains because that's just you know a lot of places or the swamp but let's go ahead and uh Get ready and get started. Now this trailer is really heavy. I hope we have enough power because it's beefed up and everything, and even off-road axles. As you see, the truck is actually, you know, it's 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 thinking about it. I'm telling you, if we can't make up this hill, I didn't think it was this heavy, really, but it should be pretty good when. Uh, you know, we do uh, have some heavy stuff and everything. It's squatting. We only have the players on it. Yeah, it's already squatting. When we put like something heavy on it's going to be bad. But the trailer is wide, kind of wider than I thought it was going to be. What in, what in stupid local tornadoes going on here? Literally, there's. I'm going to try getting in that lane. Try getting this lane. Okay, yeah, because there's a cop there, and I'm trying not to like get pulled out or anything. So he's like pull out in front of those bikers. This trailer is actually heavy. It might be too heavy. I better not be getting pulled over. That's why I got uh, lifted uh, like the pre runner soft fenders and stuff. All right, go. I'm trying to get over. Is he gonna let me over? Watch we get pulled over. I feel like we was left, uh, we, and we were let over because we're going to get pulled over, but that was hard to say. We were left over because we're going to get pulled over. I think there's bikers, or oh, those bikers are getting in trouble. Okay, he's getting gas, so we're good. Seeing some locals up here in uh, Polito. Plato's really, I mean, it is, Plato's really not that fairly used, the thing is. It's like, you've got this highway, but the traffic up here, literally this road right here, this is the worst place ever to drive. But, I mean, you know, what can you do? Golly, <laughs> it's trailer, I think this might be one of the heaviest trailers, it's crazy, because I, I just, you know, just the truck is kind of struggling. I don't know what's going on. When you get a tune or something for it, she's not rolling really a lot of coal. 
We can't have that. I think I think I'm going to go ahead and just go on up here because I was going to go up right there, but they said it's up toward the top of Mount Chiliad, so we're going to go the back way. But the bad thing is going the way we're going. There's some really bad spots, like really, really bad spots. Come on! She's to the floor right now. Cool thing is, check this out. Yeah, we got the lights. But we ain't got to use them right now because, I mean, it is daylight. It, oh, we're not really hauling anything. So that's, that's the cool thing. I really do like this truck. This is like the ultimate off-road tow rig. All right, let's curve here. Absolutely love uh, this flatbed. I think this flatbed, uh, I think it came uh, like as I was look, I was looking to order a flatbed for the old truck because I was telling the guy what I was wanting. And he's like, "Yo, I know this guy. I think his name's like Reb, and he uh, his, his company makes flatbeds and stuff. So we got like a Reb design flatbed and stuff. So it's, it's pretty cool. I like it. I like the wood and stuff on it too. Now I'm not." I think we can actually probably go this way right here. It's been so long since I've actually like been up here just riding, which is terrible. I've been uh, needing to take like a motorcycle or something up through here and just learn the trail, especially since we're going to do a lot of uh, tow recovery and stuff. Oh, old trailer doing good. It's lifted just a little bit, and um, I wanted the. Uh, the actual like uh, uh, bender wheel is taken off, so if it did flex or something like that, we're not ripping stuff off. So long as the vehicle fits on the trailer, we're good. So, I mean, that's that's the whole thing. Now I need to get on a trail that takes you up around this, and I cannot remember for the life of me, like. I think if I go through the tunnel, but I think I can get, take a right and go across. I think that's what we're going to do. Come on, baby. This is, oh. This is awkward. Excuse me, coming through. Coming through. Yeah, just, just stay right there. I'll drive around you, idiots. <laughs> oh. Alright, so I can't do that. I think I go up around here but I think there's a little flex in place I'm gonna have to go through but this truck is actually like freaking long as crap oh actually no I'm gonna go right through there all right let me I just want to take my time this is why we have an off-road trailer to go through look at that no problem I think the trailer flexes better than the truck does that's what we want I think we actually might have a setup here where we can actually do some work Come on. All right, we got this. If I can. Oh, can I make it? I just seen where somebody tweeted out they needed help, but like, I'm, if I was close, I have air compressor. Oh, somebody's getting them. Look at that, friendly neighborhood service right there. I mean, if they're tired, if they just went flat, I mean, my, I have patch kits. All right, we, we gotta make this. Oh boy, we are, come on forward now. This is why I spent like close to like a hundred some thousand dollars so we can go up in the mountains and uh, get stuff. This trailer is heavy. I did not think it was this heavy. You got to be kidding me. Come on, we, we might need to, uh, Shave some weight on it. Holy crap. Alright, I really don't... I don't know how far we gotta go up, but I don't think we're gonna make it all the way up. If we have to go up this little area here, I'm gonna have to turn around. Wait, we got somebody right here. Oh. oh is this the guy right here? I don't... Oh. He must be just looking. 
hiker. All right, I'm gonna park the truck right there. It's like I don't want it to roll down the hill. Um, I'm guessing this is they did. They said they broke an axle. Yeah, no wonder. I bet you they were trying to climb that. Um, man, this is a nice. I've had one of these. I've wrecked one. Um, <laughs> apparently somebody else has too. Uh, let's uh. Let's get a little picture right here. You know, we're just all we're just saving the day right here. I mean, that's what we're doing. Put that for Life Invader later on. Um. Okay. Uh, I don't think I can't make it up that. There's no way. So anytime I do a call or something, I'm gonna say is it above this little curve right there, because there's no way I can make a trailer up there like safely. I'll have to go up the backside and come down it, which is kind of sketch. Um, let me see. I think I can, if I can turn around here, I think I'll be all right. Um, that's just the thing. All right. If I can... Let me see. I need it to... How would I do this? I don't think there's, like, enough room for me to actually... You know, it might be. We might get lucky on this one. We might get lucky. Alright, let me back up. Take time. Alright, we're scratching a little bit, but... You know, we got at least... If I can... Can I make this turn right here? I think I might be able to. Alright, if I can back my trailer up right there. Well, it's, she's going to scratch, but it's okay. I mean, we built we built it to, you know, off off road. I mean, that that was the plan. I think I just heard somebody say, "Ah!" All right, there we go. This is not sketched at all. Oh man, can tell me I can back this thing up. I didn't think I was going to be able to. All right, we got this. Oh boy, this trailer, I'm telling you, if this trailer is absolutely heavy, this is not one of those light duty ones that usually haul. I said I wanted to be able to hold some stuff, but holy crap. All right, um, let me pull up a little bit, because I'm gonna put the ramps down too. Um, uh, I don't really want to let the trailer down because if I let the trailer down, then I could probably back my truck up beside it and kind of pull it over on its top or on its wheels. Um, I'm going to back it up a little bit. And let me go ahead and just unloosen that. Hopefully, it don't go flying down the road. Let's see. Oh... Come on, baby. Alright, this is not like sketched at all or anything. Alright, I think if I park right here. Okay, well, I don't want my wheels to be off the ground. Nope. Alright, I don't. <laughs> this is like some sketched out crap right here. Okay, I think right here will be good. Because, I mean, I'm really. It shouldn't. I think. I think I can winch to the side of that. All right, let me grab my couplers out of here. All right, I don't want to mess up, so I got some straps and everything. We got this. All right, let me go ahead and winch. All right, let's go ahead and grab that. And I think if I just basically, oh, it looks like we got a little support. Let's look it around this little support right here. All right, so I think we're good. I'm gonna see if we can get this bad boy turned over. 
Come on, baby. Turn. It's going. It's going. Come on. Come on. There we go. All right, we got it. We got it. That. Let me go ahead and grab my strap. And hey, I'm just going to tuck this up on there. All right, there we go. So I'm going to hook to the trailer again and back up to it with the ramps down. And I think we'll be all right. Oh, this is a little, <laughs> little jump up in the old truckeroo there. All right. There we go. Let's back this bad boy up. Now, this is like some... Oh, why? Well, I, I was about to back into it. Let me... All right. Got that auto hitch connection, though. Got that new, new. <laughs> All right. Um. Let me go ahead and... Let's see. I need to straighten this up a little bit. It's like some planning when you get up here. It's like, oh, I'm just going back up to it. But it's like, yeah, but where are you going back up? So from now on, I'm going to be like, which way is it facing? Of course, like, I can put it on the trailer backwards anyway. So I think we'll be good. He said it had an axle popping or a broken axle, but I think we might be able to actually back it up on the trailer. I'm going to go ahead and slam the ramps down real quick. All right. Um... Let's see, is the keys in? The keys are in it, is from what I'm seeing. It's like, I don't think anybody would really steal it or anything. So, I'm going to go ahead and back it up on a trailer. Oh, she just like popped or something. I don't know what that is. All right, let's just. All right, we got. Looks like everything's good on it. Let's go ahead and back it up. On the trailer and everything. Check that out. Like, tell me that just doesn't look good. I'm going to take a little old sel or I would say a selfie. I'm going to take a thing. Uh, a picture. This is really our first recovery with this thing. So I've got that strapped down. Um, I'm going to go ahead and throw the ramps up. And we're going to try to make our way down. Slowly but surely. But I don't know. It's, it's going to be a little. It's going to be a little iffy going down. Got the ramps. We, we are. Uh, we're ready. Oh man. Like I am, It is kind of like sketchy going down this hill. Because we have the, the, the side by side and the trailer now. With that trailer like being that heavy, that's bad. But I think um, I might end up putting uh, the air ride um, helper bags on the rear so we can raise it up to uh, match what we're hauling. So we aren't, you know, we're riding level at all times, especially going uphill or something. All right, take your time. All right, even though we break, I mean, uh, oh, uh, trailer brakes are working good. Okay, so we're good. Oh, watch out now. Here, let me let me turn on my lights here. Let people know we're coming down. <laughs> I think we can actually go take a left up here and go through the tunnel well, no actually over the mountain here and just go on into sandy instead of going like on the main highway I think that would probably be our best bet and I think it's actually this way to the floor I gotta say though oh four we did a little bit of spinning it seems a little sluggish hauling this but we rolling like there ain't no tomorrow. I don't think this is actually the right road. Um, uh, no. It isn't. I think we should have took... We want that road right there. So we need to go back. Okay, I think I took the, the wrong exit. So... We need to actually back up. I think and I can, I can actually make... Can I make a turn here? Let me swing it wide. This truck is big, but man, these trees right here, they're like ginormous. It's like, oh yeah, this is a big old tree. I think we got this. I didn't want the truck to be too big, but like a big F4 door F350, 
it's huge and then we added a basically a you know I think it's like an 8 to 10 foot bed on it so I kind of counter um I'm thinking the road we need on is down oh man I bet you we're gonna have to flex through that hole again I flex through it watch this we got this flexing on trailer all right Oh yeah, Are we rubbing back there on the bed though. I see that for a fact. Uh oh, oh, I can't get stuck because I'm the one people call when they get stuck off road. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. On the road again. Oh crap! I forgot. I've got to go up this hill. All right, I'm just gonna floor it and hope for the best. Oh, we're dragging this old trailer. I legit has more flex than my truck does, and I absolutely love it because I'm watching the actuals back there. Perfect. All right, we did good. We did good. Dude, they've been down here just like talking. They're like, where that guy came from? Yeah, we did haul this. Yeah, just just stand right there and I'll drive around you, okay? Thank you. We are wide open right now. I think that side besides a little bit crooked, but it'll be okay. <laughs> I, it's to the floor. She's a screaming though. Oh! Oh, coming through, excuse me, excuse me. From the paperwork, let me see, hang on, let me, let me see, I gotta get my, get my paperwork here. All right, um, is this the, I think that's it. Um, I think this address, I'm believing it's like right outside of uh, Stab City. I think we take it right there at the uh, main road, and that's where we got hollering. I guess I'm just going this way. Hope I don't meet anybody. That would suck. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to make a big turn here, and there's a vehicle coming. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Thank you. Alright, windows down. Should have down to begin with. So if I, if it's like if it's like snowing or I'm like off roading or something and I, I've got to drive good, I always uh, I have to have my windows down so I can. Basically, if you get your windows down, you drive better. I think that's like a proven fact, to be honest. Oh, whoa, Lee, holy gigantic pothole back there! Literally bounced the trailer up in the air. <laughs> I mean, oh, uh, I was wondering what that was. It was a bush. All right, we got to watch these, like, potholes here. They get you. I would do a burnout in the bridge, but I'm afraid we're going to break an axe, uh, break a sh uh, dry shaft or something. I do like this truck is uh, leaf sprung all the way around so we can haul, like, a little bit heavier loads. And I'll probably add a, uh, like a helper uh, air ride system on a truck so we can lift it. Cause she's sitting down a little bit. A lot actually. There we go. Alright, so we're getting close. I mean, not too too far away, but far enough. They pulling over, they're like, oh, oh, Jim Bob and the uh, uh, general and hamster wheels tow and recovery went and got it. That's what I'm saying. This truck would be good for a repo truck, too, with the trailer. I see that bed sitting there. I'm like, oh, that's an old, uh, that's a cop or something, but it was just an old truck bed. Head on this way, and I think we're going to take a ride up here. 
drop it off at a house. Anything coming? All right, flooring it. That's to the floor right there. That legit is to the floor. <laughs> is this the house? This is, what is this, 917? Yep, this is it. And it said park it behind back, so I'm guessing this is behind back. They only have a driveway in the front, so I don't, <laughs> I'm guessing this is going to be behind back. I'm just going to back it out there. Let's see, we'll back it on. Back it on up! I'm telling you, I drove back up long trailers because these shorter trailers are really hard to do. All right, now, I think that over there is actually a different house, so, I'm, this is it. Okay, well, you know what? I'm just going back it right here, and if this ain't his house, then he needs to, you know, put on the paper better. All right, let me get the ramps down, and we'll go ahead and get this off. Basically, just drive it off and park it there, and we are out of here. Get these straps off. Can get this thing off. I don't want to go too fast. I don't want to break anything. Well, it's already got a broken axle apparently. And cage is a little. It's a little scratched up, but not that bad. All right, there we go. I'm gonna throw my ramps up, and we are out of here. Um, I think the guy actually already paid or put a deposit of us actually coming to get and stuff. So I'll call Denise, get her to, uh, you know, tell the guy, hey, it's been delivered and stuff, and we're good to go. Let me go ahead and grab the uh, ramps up. Ramps are up. We are ready to rock and roll. All right. That was a successful, um, basically recovery is what that was. Until until next time, I'm gonna haul it this way. Come on, America! Well, I tell you, <laughs> like we don't got a lot of America going on because this trailer is heavy as crap.